Hello, so we are back and this time we have a proper nice laptop to repair. You have to remember this laptop if you are on this business from a long time. Yeah, this is an old uh, old laptop, kind yeah, it's it's old. MD Vision, free course and uh, MD graphics. You remember this one? I mean, this laptop was mad expensive when it um, came out. And every model has the same issue. Now, this one, let me plug a charger, just to understand the fault. I plug in the charger, and the laptop will start charging, or yeah, yeah, start charging. You can see the charging light here, yeah. Pressing the power button, the laptop is coming on, we know uh, backlight and no picture on the screen, so that's the issue. You can see the laptop it's on, it's taking like over two amps, but nothing. And uh, the customer tried to fix it himself. The customer bought a screen. Yeah, so here we have like a brand new screen. Of course, he replaced the screen and uh, still not working. Because this laptop has a specific fold, yeah? And I'm gonna show you the fold. You can see the fold from outside. So check here, you can see the heat sink. So here is the CPU, yeah? And here you have a small sink on the same pipe and that's the dedicated uh, graphic chip. And that's the issue. That was the time when the chips, they have uh, AMD and Nvidia, they have problems with the chip itself. The solution, there's uh, not that many solution for this, uh, for this repair, but I'm gonna show you how we can fix it. Now, all we have to do is to take the, the palm rest out and the keyboard, and we can fix it from there. Just give me like two minutes to, to take the palm rest out. You see, this one is coming from the time you can, uh, you know, customer can actually replace the keyboard by himself. Not anymore, not anymore. Because we are more advanced technologically speaking. Yeah. Now, if you have a broken keyboard, you buy another laptop. Mm -hmm. But hey, this is called progress, huh? I think progress has uh, different meaning for uh, different people. When it's about them, it is progress. Probably they are making more money selling laptops. But when it's about us, it's just, you know, we are going backwards. You have to think we are like, what, like 15 years later, and this laptop probably just now uh, died, I mean, 15 years later. Today laptops are like, you know, they are working on the warranty time. Now, this is a nice classic motherboard. Yeah, this is the power button. Let's plug the power button back. So one more time, plug in the charger, pressing the power button. Yeah, and the laptop is coming, you can see the fan spinning, yeah. Yeah, you can see the light here, yeah, the laptop is on, it's taking like one amp, but of course, uh, nothing on screen. Now the solution, the solution is very simple, you take the hot air, around 480 degrees, no nozzle, and you heat the GPU from the back. The GPU is here. Like, I don't know, 20, 30 seconds, something like that. Yeah, let's try, let's try again. Let me cool down the GPU. Yeah, the, sink, the heating is just warm, it's okay. Now plug in the power, pressing the power button. Let's see. I'm pretty sure this is the fault. Oh, we have picture, huh? We have picture. You see? Yeah, that's the problem. That's the problem. So how uh, to approach this kind of repair? Huh? I mean, you can do a lot better. You can take out the heatsink, yeah? 
then you be sure you're replacing a thermal paste or thermal pad. Not sure what, uh, we can have like a thermal pad, this one. Then on the back, yeah, on the back you use some thermal pad here. And uh, yeah, this is no metal. Yeah, you can use some thermal pad to, you know, just to get the heat to spread uh, around, the, around the board. Uh, what you can do better is, you know, just be sure if the fan is clean, the heat sink. But not much what you can do. This is an internal cheap issue. It's not a soldering ball or something like that. Now, you can say no to the repair. Uh, and I don't agree with that, you know, just saying no to something which you know you can fix it. And you'll be surprised. Some laptops, they come back like next day. But some laptops, they work for years. And this issue is coming when actually uh, overheating happens inside of the laptop. As soon as you reheat the GPU and you clean the fan and the, the heat sink, it will work fine for a while. I mean, you can treat this like a normal repair and you give warranty. Or you can 100% uh, you can, you can tell the customer, you know, this is like a temporary fix. And you can explain him the problem and the customer you'll be surprised, but he will choose to fix the laptop just to take his data out. Because, you know, I mean, yeah, you can take the hard drive out, you can, you have to spend money for a caddy, you know, to put the caddy inside. Then for a normal customer, this is kind of, you know, a little bit more complicated. So they will choose to fix the laptop, even if it's like a temporary fix. And even if you, let's say, you charge money for a normal repair and you give warranty and the customers come back on a warranty, you redo the job again, you give another three months warranty, and so on. Now, this, yeah, the laptop is not working because I, 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 I you know, the, the board is hot. No, it's because we heat up the, the chip. Pressing the power button, and now it will work every time. 100%. Yeah, it's working. Okay. So yeah, I mean, this laptop, you know, just bring me like nice memory. I mean, we, I fixed so many. On that time, a lot of laptops, they have this kind of GPU issue. And uh, not only normal laptops, even the MacBooks. So yeah, this is, this is a fix. For me, it's a fix, you know. Your laptop came dead. Now it's living, working. It's a matter of warranty, how long it will work. But that's the reason why we give warranty on the first place, right? Just to be sure. You know, the customer has a fair deal. In this case, uh, in this case, I'm not uh, going to move forward or try to make it work longer. Um, I'm going to, you know, I'll just uh, tell them to let the customer know and, you know, he can recover the day, this, his data. And, yeah, of, of course, the computer will be able to charge something, yeah? I mean, I give you a few days of work, months, years, I don't know, but... I give you a working laptop, so you can charge something. I'm just saying, because saying no, it's actually the worst case. I mean, you know, it's, it's not making sense. You are a computer shop. You're supposed to fix things. I know you can do, you cannot do like a proper fix, but, you know, just, you know, give a little bit more time. The laptop is on a terminal stage, and you try to make uh, the life longer as possible, right? Yeah, just... Uh, just a short video. If you have this kind of old laptops, they have a dedicated GPU chip. Um, this can be the reason. And the fact, actually, you have no backlight and no picture. That's not the screen. Perfect. So I'm going to stop now. I will say uh, thank you for watching. You know, like, subscribe if you like the video, like always. And see you on the next one. Yeah, this is quite a nice surprise to see this board, this laptop. Yeah, bye.